A fan leaves behind something bizarre at a Sunderland soccer game. Hey everyone, thanks for hanging out with us here at The Fumble. I'm Jessica Wills reminding you to click that subscribe button so you never miss an update on your favorite sports teams and athletes. This weekend, this photo was making the rounds on social media showing a fan appearing to be dropping a deuce right there in his stadium seat. He was eventually arrested by stadium security, but take a look at the onlookers just standing there watching him. So the guy in question is actually a 17-year-old kid named Callum Mawson, and he came forward to explain that wasn't exactly what happened. As you might have guessed, Callum said he had a little too much to drink that day. He recalls that he drank 12 bottles of Bud and six pints of Strongbow and only had a couple pieces of chocolate. That is what you call the breakfast of champion blackouts. Mawson only remembers getting to the stadium, going to his seat, and then later being in the stadium's holding cell. Besides the obvious question of why is a 17-year-old drinking, this is England, remember? They can drink at 18, so that's like a 20-year-old here in America, and we all know the 20-year-olds drink. But more importantly, where is his friends when he needs them? Which brings me to my fumble question of the day. European soccer games are crazy. What is the craziest thing you've seen at a sporting event? Let me know in the comments below. Apparently, a lot of people have been calling out Mawson and he said, I don't know what was going through my head when I did it, I really don't. There's been people messaging me, giving me hate. I don't want people to think I don't care. I am ashamed of it. There's no excuse for what I've done. I regret my actions, but there is no need for such hurtful comments. I understand why it's had so much attention, but I don't appreciate the lies. Everyone give him a break. He's 17 and he said, sorry. I would love to see the things that you did at 17 while you were drunk. He gets a pass from me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. Thanks for spending time with us here at The Fumble, and I'll see you next time.